Eight for the most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. Oh, we know that saying spring showers bring May flowers and you know what? We're getting our spring showers in, so I'm excited to see what flowers we're going to be getting soon. March precipitation so far this month, we've seen 2.84 inches of rain and we're only on day nine and we're going to see more today, probably dry tomorrow, more on Saturday and looking ahead to next week. We'll get there later, but I just want to point out that this is a rainy time period. March rainfall usually is about three and a half inches and we are well on our way. We're a third of the way through almost temperature wise this morning um warm for this time of year it's 46 degrees there's still a crispness in the air 43 in monet 42 in ava and 44 in mountain grove currently on our satellite and radar look at that plume of moisture now we are starting to see a few showers develop in our area we were talking about parts of howell county shannon and oregon county starting to see a little bit of rain but this isn't the bulk of the rain that we're going to see that's starting to develop out really along i-35 in parts of kansas and into oklahoma and then that's going to continue right into our area. And with that, we're going to see widespread rainfall across the Ozarks today. Now, not a washout by any stretch, but just widespread showers, if you will. This is at 930 AM. You can see a few places where there's a little bit more of the reds and the yellows or the oranges, we could see heavier rainfall at this time. Heaviest of rainfall is going to be down into Arkansas. This is at 3 p.m. showers moving off to the east. We're still seeing some lingering light rain in the Springfield area, and then overnight we should dry out. We should have a mostly dry Friday as well. So for your commute forecast today, I think yellow light, just wet roadways early on by this afternoon. I think that'll be mostly out of here. Some spotty showers will be possible. Just keep in mind if you have your, your windshield wipe, on, you're going to want your headlights on too. Today's highs, mm, low 50s. It's going to be a chilly one across the area. Overnight temperatures are staying in the mid 30s, so this is about where we should be for this time of the year. It will be a little breezy tonight into tomorrow. Now, we've got the rain for today. <laughs> We're going to dry out for your Friday, and then a good chance of rain Saturday into Sunday before kind of drying out to start next week. Looking ahead, I mean, we've already talked about the rain for today. This is on Saturday at 1 30 p.m., kind of widespread showers across the area. That rain will linger into your Sunday morning by sunrise Sunday morning. I think will be mostly dry through the weekend. Counting today, we will likely see half of an inch to an inch of rain more to the south where they could see a couple of inches of rain. So flooding could be an issue by the end of this weekend for your seven day forecast. Cool. I mean, it's going to stay cool as we start spring break. Of course, rainy and breezy on Saturday, Sunday rain early, but I want you to look ahead to Wednesday. 60 degrees. Doesn't that look nice? <laughs> that looks nice. All right. Well, it's going to be chilly, but let's look ahead to Wednesday. Thanks, Natalie.